it has been over a year now since I unboxed and started wearing my Keen Lansing boots. So here they are, worn out, ready to be retired. Let's see what we liked, what we didn't like. Some of the things I liked about this boot is they were comfortable right out of the box. Nice and comfy, very short uh, break-in period. I also liked the mid-height side. So I had some good support on the ankle, but they weren't too tall, so they were easy to get on and off. I'm also going to have to say these round laces, which I have actually kind of hated in the past, they held up really well. Uh, on this pair of boots. I've had about four pairs of Keens and usually these break after just a couple of months, uh, but these actually did hold up really well. Uh, this is the original pair after over a year. Uh, on this side, the left boot, I'll show you the right boot in a minute, they didn't last, but these round ones did actually hold up. So I don't know if Keen changed the way they make these, or maybe I just got some duds in the back. Insoles also held up well. Little wear there, that's to be expected. These babies, as you can see, are well worn. So uh, I wore the bottoms right off. Again, food service will do that to you. And uh, they got kind of slippery towards the end of their life, but not going to complain. Did a lot of ramp work, which really tears up boots. And overall, the tread was pretty good. The right boot took a little bit more of a beating, and you can see I had to do some emergency laces. So uh, my laces broke. I didn't have spare laces with me, so all I had was some wire to tie them up to get me through the day. And I had already ordered my new Kansas City boots, uh, so I didn't really want to invest too much in these. Uh, and it worked. It uh, got me through, but these laces did break, uh, which is very common on those round laces like I was showing you uh, on this one. But, uh, you know, they did last over a year, so I will say that they were improved. The top of this boot, too, really took a beating. So this is my right foot. Uh, so it's my dominant foot, so there's a few things going on there with these boots. But I scoop and unscoop uh, all the stacks of food that I deliver, and that takes a beating on the top. So the eyelets broke here, uh, and there's also wear uh, on the side. So again, I'm not going to complain too much because they did last over a year, uh, but that is one spot that did end up taking a beating, and these little eyelets both failed, uh, so then... You could only tie the boots at the top. I've actually had this on a few boots before, though, and uh, most of the Keens, as long as you can get the top tight, you can still wear the boots for a few weeks while you're waiting for your new one. The bottoms of these boots, not quite as bad as the left foot, foot <laughs> surprisingly, but uh, definitely worn as well, but held up. Overall, I will say these are a buy. I would buy the Keen Lansing work boots again. Held up well, they were comfortable most of the time, kept my feet dry, and the laces were even decent on this pair. They're old, they're beat up, they're well used now, uh, and this is the end of their life for me. So thanks for watching, everybody. Uh, I just bought a pair of Keen Kansas City boots. You can check out my channel uh, for a review and an unboxing on those, and I'll eventually do a one-year video on that as well. So please like, subscribe, comment, Thanks for watching. Goodbye, old friends. You've served me well.